guys, it's Caitlin. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you're new to my channel, I appreciate you being here. Feel free to subscribe and stick around. If you're old to my channel, you all know I love you. Um, so I wanted to, as you can tell by the title of this video, it is a little bit of a different video than what I've done in the past. This channel was mainly dedicated to my weight loss and my surgery, um, or my journey through weight loss surgery and kind of the updates and um, what I've gone through for that. But I also really love doing the inside the dressing room videos, which I've done a few of, and I love makeup, and I love watching makeup. I watch a ton of YouTube videos um, about makeup and reviews and hauls and tutorials and things like that, and I figured this is my channel and I'm gonna do what I want, so I would like to post some of my makeup obsession on this channel, and so I figured I would start that with this fabulous haul. Um, I was able to partake in the Sephora VIB Rouge sale, which is an annual sale where you get a code for 20% off every item in the store. Still ridiculously expensive. I feel like, um, I feel like based off of the amount of money I spent, I should have had a lot more product than I actually do, but the products that I did get were very exciting, so I'm excited to show them to you guys. Obviously, if this isn't, you know, the type of video that you'd like to watch on my channel, please feel free not to. Um, you know, y'all can pick and choose what videos uh, speak to you and that you would like to tune into, um, and I appreciate you being here and sticking around through uh, through everything and being with me through thick and thin, people. We are, we are in a relationship. So please don't leave me because I'm doing makeup videos, guys. Okay. So the first product that I picked up, I was very, okay, we'll do the boring one. I got the Laura Mercier Secret Brightening Powder. Um, there you go. Again, kind of boring, but I needed a powder to bake under my eyes and I've never actually tried the Secret Brightening Powder. I was using the Cody Airspun Powder. Is that what it's called? Cody Airspun? I don't know. I was using the powder from the drugstore and I used it up and I haven't bought any uh, purchased any since so I figured I would take advantage of the sale and get the Laura Mercier brightening powder um, I've used it a couple times the secret brightening powder and I do like it it is pretty bright under <laughs> excuse me under the eye the second product that I picked up was the Kevin Aquan um, book of contour something like that volume 2 the contour book volume 2 so this does have a nice little uh, instructional piece in the front here and then we get into it and we have the sculpting cream up top we have his candlelit cream then we have the sculpting and candlelit powders and then some really pretty um, eye eyeshadows I've never used I've never used Kevin Aquan in the past um, I've heard great things Hello, about the sculpting powder so I was really excited to kind of try everything all at once um, and I have been using the sculpting powder and the cream can't really tell in this fabulous like bright light over here but um, I have been using it and I've really been enjoying it so I'm very excited to continue to play with that the next product that I have here is by Visard or Viseard I don't really know how to say it I've been wanting to try the Viseard Visard palette for quite some time but again they are pretty expensive um, okay you hear that construction that they just magically started? Um, I've been wanting to try the palettes, the, like the larger palettes for quite some time, but they're like pretty expensive, so I haven't. So I went and picked up one of the Theory palettes in Minx. It is really beautiful. I have not used it yet, um, but this is what it looks like. Like, look at the colors. I'm sorry. Okay, ready? Flipping you off, but can you see that? Like, it's stunning. The colors are so buttery and creamy and so pigmented, you guys. Ready? Like, gorgeous. I, the sunlight is not my friend today, I apologize, you guys. Um, <clears throat> so I'm really excited. Like I said, I haven't had the chance to play with that, um, but I'm really super excited to get into it. The next item that I bought is the second to last item that I bought, I told you, I feel like I spent a lot of money, but I didn't get a ton. But I am super excited about these next two products. This, um, I'm so excited. It is one of the Natasha Denona palettes. It's her five pan palette. Again, we're not gonna focus. Can we see? And then you guys, look at the colors. It's her palette number 10. Let's see, get you up close and personal, you guys. You know you want it. Look at these colors. Okay, again, with the swatch fest. Ready? Ah, oh, are you fucking kidding me? You guys, I literally cannot. I'll try this one because it's so bright, you guys. Look at these colors. No, you cannot. Ready? Oh, 
I have other spots. It is a little bit powdery. I will say that, like the glittery shades are a little bit powdery because I just got them all over the place. Um, but I'm okay with that. <clears throat> On this palette, I'm okay with it. Um, it's They're really beautiful. I can't even get over it. I can't even handle it. I have like random swatches on my arm. <laughs> and then the last product, again, you guys, I'm super excited because it's the Natasha Denona Star Palette. I have been dying for this, dying. I've been watching everybody's videos. I think I saw Tati's video, and I was just like, I have to have it. So I made my boyfriend buy it for me for Christmas. <laughs> um, so this, okay. This one is a little bit, um, some of the shades in here are a little bit frustrating because of the, the how powdery they are. Like this shade right here, you can see, look at all the fallout. I haven't even used this on my eyes yet. I swatched it yesterday and then that's all the shot, the fallout from it. But like, take a minute just to appreciate the colors. You wanna see them up close? Okay, I can do that. Like, just stunning. And I think it's really the duochrome, like, um, Look, look how powdery that is and I barely touched it. Look at that. And look at it, it's like, like ruining the, pa the actual shadow. I don't know. I have a finger full of, I don't know. One of my favorites down here is this gold one. Because <sighs> I'm literally barely touching these. Oh, that one too, look at that, look at the powder. Do you see like how chunky it is? Wow. So that's a little frustrating, but you know, it is what it is. It's Natasha Denona. Denona. Again, the Natasha Denona palettes are pretty pricey. I think the Star palette is like 160 or 169, and then the Five Pan palette was like 48. I feel like the Five Pan palette that's not that bad. I don't know. Am I crazy for thinking that's not that bad? Definitely think I might actually get some more colors. The Star palette. I do love the colors, like it's beautiful. I'm just gonna have to figure out a way to get over the actual chunky fallout of the duochrome shadows because it is pretty intense. Um, but they're beautiful, the, the mattes blend, gorgeous, like they're just stunning and I'm really, really excited. Um, I'm getting swatch everywhere over here. So hope you guys enjoyed that short little haul that cost me about a million dollars. Um, feel free to go ahead and leave comments down below if you'd like to see something specific from me in the future. Again, makeup, beauty related, hair, obviously I don't do hair. I have no idea how to do here. If you have any suggestions or videos that you'd like to see from me in the future, please feel free to leave them down below. I'm happy to do any type of makeup tutorial, beauty video, favorites, um, face of the month, things like that, whatever you guys want to see. And you know, obviously I'll still continue to do like my updates for my weight loss and everything uh, on this channel as well. But like I said, it's my channel and I'll do what I want. <laughs> and I really, I love watching YouTube. That's what I watch. I watch YouTube makeup tutorials and videos and, and everything and it really inspires me. And I love to share that kind of love and appreciation for makeup and beauty with you guys as well. Thank you guys again so much for watching. I really appreciate each and every one of you and I will see you next time. Bye guys.